Welcome back to Rangers Ballpark in Arlington as we head to the bottom of the third. Mitch Moreland coming up to bat, and unless you've been living under a rock, you're well aware of the fact that Mitch has been swinging a hot bat lately. It was a tough start to the season. Mitch says he tries to take, uh, not to take the lows too low or the highs too high. Try to get my work in in all aspects, and you know, I, I might not be the fastest or uh, you know move the best, but you know that's something that I'm going to work on and continue to work on every day, and uh, as, as well as my hitting. So. You know, it's something that's uh, always going to be a work in progress for me. I can always get better. So, you know, that's all, that's kind of the, my mentality about the whole situation. You know, just keep keep working at it, and uh, you know, I'll I'll work at it until I'm done. And obviously, we've seen both sides of his game bleed over into each other, uh, flashing the leather of late, as well as hitting the ball quite nicely, guys. Yeah, thanks, Emily. Yeah, very true. Uh, Mitch, a very complete player, drives this one high and deep to left center field. That is way up the alley. Goodbye. Mullen going opposite alley. It's five to two, Texas. Well, Anibal Sanchez only given up one home run in 52 innings coming into this game. And Mitch Mullen doing what he's done all season long, driving the ball to all fields with power. And, you know, I like what Mitch said. He's going to work on his agility and his speed. And he does have more agility and more speed. And we talked about that defensively and on the bases. The work that he's doing is paying off because he looks different and he moves different. And it's not by accident. 